Hey, this is rowing. Oklahoma City Barons team building. Well, we had a team building event out here at the Boathouse, Boathouse District, and I'm standing here with uh, Baron star forward, Mark Arcabello. Mark, it's to my understanding that you have had some experience in this aspect. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Um, well, I did uh, rowing my senior year of uh, high school as a mandatory third sport. Um, so I had a little bit of experience with it. It was good to get back out on the, on the water today, and it was good for a lot of the guys to try something new. Like you said, you've had some experience, but anything that you picked up that you didn't know before? Uh, I, I didn't know that a lot of uh, our teammates couldn't do it as easy as I thought they would. Um, you know, Brian Helmer had a lot of trouble, especially uh, out on the water. But uh, it, was, it was fun to, to learn a little, bit, a little bit more of the fundamentals inside. And then I think uh, our team, the, uh, the first group out on the water, uh, Got a little bit of a head start on the training aspect and that kind of carried over into our victory. Standing here with the rower, why don't you introduce yourself to um, My name is Ryan Shelton. Ryan Shelton, okay. Ryan, where do you come from? I actually am born and raised in Southern California. You're a pretty big dude. Uh, is it pretty common to have, uh, to be, like, is that an asset, I guess, in rowing or is there different kind of like, like categories or weight or height categories, restrictions or something like that? Yeah, it's absolutely uh, a, a big help. You know, generally rowers are going to be a lot bigger guys a little guy is like 6'2 you oh, wow. know some of the bigger guys start sitting hitting like 6'9 or so um, but there's uh, open weight you can be any weight you want any size you want uh, and then there's lightweight and you have to be uh, 160 pounds or less to okay. compete in those and those those are the, uh, the little guys out there so it's safe to say Mark Arcabello cannot be a professional rower. We noticed that you were on the losing boat. Uh, just a quick, uh, quick question. What happened? Why did your team fall apart? And uh, what was the overall uh, morale after you guys lost? Well, we actually had a, uh, a rigor break. So everything was going well and splendidly just like we thought, you know, and we were going we were gonna to win the race. And then uh, one of our our poor rowers, uh, or one of your hockey players, his rigor just came apart and started flopping all over. And so we ended up rowing with seven guys instead of eight. And so you lose uh, quite a bit of horsepower when one person goes down. So the other team got lucky. If they come out here again, things will be a bit different, I can guarantee it. Well, at the end of the day, we still won. And I'm pretty excited and proud about that and think I might retire at 1-0.